This guy here dresses up like a real life superhero and stops crime like this above. But although this superhero has been fighting crime for almost three years, has toys and comic books made after him, and has even saved many people from danger. From the right, this guy comes dashing in, just wearing this skin tight rubber black and golden suit and starts chasing him away. Sadly, this superhero is not what he seems, and under that mask lies a dark secret that will turn his loving fans into people that will hate him in the end. Phoenix Jones, you're not a hero, you're a fraud. This is the story of Phoenix Jones who's a crime fighter in the city of Seattle in the US. And just like many superheroes, his superpowers are martial arts fighting, a net launcher, handcuffs, and a first aid kit. Not only that, he wears a super suit that protects him like this. Underneath here, there's a bulletproof yeah. vest that goes through here. And then this is a special material. If you push it, it's soft, right? Yeah. But then give it a good punch. It gets hard on impact. So it's, it's, it's impenetrable. Can't stab or do anything. And with these equipments he wears, he fights crime with his team of heroes where they would help the homeless stop robberies and protect people from danger. A man was getting violent with me and my group of friends. Phoenix ran in and defused the entire situation. But although many people love this hero, the police did not as they see these superheroes as a problem. Where one day, Phoenix Jones was arrested for accidentally hurting someone, which in the end, he had to reveal his secret identity to the whole world. I'm Phoenix Jones, Jack the City, I also am a father, I'm just like uh, everyone else. Revealing to everyone that he was Ben Fodor, a professional MMA fighter who started to do crime fighting after his son and his friend was hurt by bad people. And when he tried to ask the police for help, it didn't help much. That's when he decided to be a hero. It's great that you want to help, but why do you feel the need to do it in those outfits? Because it's a symbol. It tells people and drug dealers and criminals and anyone else that when you see this outfit and these group of people, we stand for a message. And the message is that we're against violence and we're against crimes that you're trying to do. But like I said at the start of the video, this superhero isn't what he seems to be. Because later on, he was found selling drugs and was arrested by the police once again. So what do you think? Is Phoenix Jones a superhero or is he a criminal?